And I'm here with Mark, and we're gonna be building some spawners today. Is that what we're gonna be doing today? Is that did yeah. you just did well, you just make that I'm, up? Huh? Huh? I'm gonna be building some spawners. <laughs> All right. <laughs> we're gonna be building some spawners today, guys. Uh, we were notified by our faction that our faction money, because we keep a nice like you know keep a nice balanced faction money available to everybody, is running fairly low. It's because we obviously destroyed our last blaze spawner and our last uh, iron golem spawner room, so we have no income coming in as of right now and uh, what we did we basically just set up a bunch of chests like we have a bunch of chests and trap chests here if we need and um, what I'm gonna be doing I'm gonna be building a iron golem grinder right here and Brent what are you doing I'm building a blaze spawner thing a blaze spawner thing nice nice a blaze spawner thing so uh, Brent told me that he had the capacity to actually build a actual blaze spawner. So I was like, no way you know how to build one of those. And I was, he's like, you know what? I'm, out I'm, a <laughs> I'm about to show you right now. So then he's going to try his hardest. Oh my gosh, I don't have an axe. That's a pain in the butt. He's going to try his hardest today to make a, I guess, one of those spawners. And um, if he fails, then he gets kicked out of the faction. And uh, if he doesn't fail, then he gets a lot of money and a lot of hugs from uh, D-Field. All right, so uh, yeah. So I'm going to build this because obviously I think... Um, I think that using iron golems are a lot effective or a lot more effective compared to using the um, blaze spawners. But, you know, you know, some people think differently and uh, they're to each his own. own. Exactly. I was just about to say that. It's like we were about to think we were like thinking the same thing right there, man. <laughs> All right. So um, if we've built this. I've built one of these spawners plenty of times, guys. So you guys should know exactly what I'm doing. Um, let's actually I want I want to hear what Brent's doing right now. Brent, explain to the audience how how uh, like if you if this was a tutorial. Explain it right now. Okay. This episode is all you. Go ahead. So I've done this before, but pretty much I'm just guessing along the way and kind of <laughs> just uh, working with what I got. Okay. And Kiwi's helping me out. Oh, what a guy. He's a good. Look he's, at that. Look at that. He's a good guy already, then, huh? Already got this going, but I gotta make this look nice, so I gotta keep him out of the way a little bit. All right. Well, well, since you guys are doing that, uh, make sure the front of the base is actually pointing over there, so like the collection area is in like the same place. Yeah, yeah. You, you feel me? You feel me? Oh yeah, that's fine. That's fine. That's not a big deal. Yours is yours is never gonna be as long as mine. You know, it's not. You know, oh, this oh, is okay, this is one of those. This is one of those things where it's kind of just rela relatable to real life. You're like, you'll just never be as like long you're as me. Compensating. <laughs> uh, I don't know what you're talking about right now. We're, t we're talking about uh, spotter builds over here, bro. What the heck? That's what I'm talking about. Uh, what else? What else could I be referring to? Get the, get the heck out of here, bro. <laughs> you got columns, I got blazes. You yeah, dude. I feel like I feel like you have no idea what you're doing. What is, what is Kiwi doing? He's messing up our cool little glowstone design. What are you doing, man? What is he doing oh, over no. there? What the freak? <laughs> Whatever, I'm not gonna pay attention to him. So the, the hardest part, the hardest part about actually doing the iron gold, it's not really hard, it's just like the, the part that's the most time consuming of doing this is like, I have to place a ton of hoppers, and then I have to place a ton of signs, and then since I'm OCD, I like to place the lava like perfectly. So if you finish your farm before I finish mine, you're probably gonna have to place me, like help me place all that stuff too. I don't know if I'm even gonna finish it. <laughs> well, I, I, what was our time limit? I, I said I'd give you a 15 minute speed build. So you got 15 oh, minutes to build geez, that. Man. And if not, we're going to have to pause the recording just for Brent. <laughs> and then oh, uh, we'll go from there. Uh, how do I get back up? Okay, wait, I got this. Dude, got just, just use a, yeah, just use a building block. It doesn't matter. What, what color glass did you get again? Blue. We had like guys. We had like a like a five minute conversation on what glass you should use, and I was like, "Oh, I'll get white glass." And he was like a racist, and I was like, "Okay, fine. I'll, I'll grab blue glass. I'll, I'll grab the blue glass." And he's like, "Racist. You're you you hate Smurfs." And I'm like, "What are you talking about? Like, what the heck?" So he grabbed the blue glass. Oh, he's going. You're going all out. You're making it look sexy. I'm over here just speed building. I gotta make it look nice. No, all right. Dude, okay. All right. Nice. I feel you. I feel you. I feel you. Um. All right. Let me grab more if hoppers it's not here. Nice, then what is this all for? Um. You know, just for funsies, not, a, not nothing too big. Of course, we don't need, we don't need these. We don't, we don't need money. It's you know, money's not, a, money's not a big deal on factions. It's like, <laughs> um, I have yet to see a huge blaze or a huge iron golem farm on factions. Like, like I haven't seen one yet on factions purple because I think that people actually underestimate it. Like a lot of people are like, oh, iron ingots are only five bucks each. Or like, why are people still selling it? I don't understand that the, that the, we make like how much were we making? Oh, I don't even think you used that farm before, did you? I was making like I five million or so, 
Kiwi, can can you make some signs? And and we'll make the lava blade. Wood is in the is in the chests. All right, perfect. Ki Kiwi's gonna yeah, go ahead. Kiwi's gonna start helping me out with the wood over here because uh, we're freaking the signs take the longest for this. Oh my gosh, yours is looking nice and beautiful. Mine's gonna look like crap. So uh, design wise, yours is probably gonna be a lot better than mine, but um. Functionality wise, I think both of our farms are actually turning out pretty well here. We'll see if mine even works. So. <laughs> well, I'm pretty, I'm pretty sure it's like a, there's just like a, a like you, you can't really, like you can't really mess up a blaze farm, Brent. I don't know. Yeah, I don't... it's like a, a squared plus b squared equals c squared. No, that's 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 a, that's time. the Pythagorean theorem. That doesn't work no, for this situation. I'm pretty sure it works with blaze. Uh, I don't, I don't think so, man. I don't... <laughs> Uh, pretty, pretty sure. What? That doesn't, even, that doesn't even make any sense. What the heck? Where does the black glass, glass go? I just bought some. Uh, might be on the other side of the... Sh no, wait. Is it right I here? I see your black glass through my glass. I know. It's because of the obsidian, man. It's because of the obsidian. Where is the black glass? But I see my blue glass. Okay, what the heck? I just... I literally just bought some. Where are they? No, it's. I think it's on this side of the shop. Um... So, so you're just making, oh, here it is. You're just making the, um, what's it called? You're just making the normal kind of farm where they just kind of flow down using a water source. Oh, uh, yeah. So. Right, I'm going to, I'm going to NFC Kiwi. I'm just going to freak him out here a little bit. I'm going to steal some of his signs. <laughs> He's going to be like, what the heck? But, uh, let me help him out. This is the, this is the part that takes the longest with, uh, the signs, just placing them all down. Oh, uh, yeah, dude, we're going to, we're going to beat you, that. man. We're going to beat you. Um, by the way, um, we have 17 blaze spawners. So make sure Ooh. the the thing that you're making should like it, it should be tall enough at least so that it, um those blaze spawners are you know oh so that should maybe make it taller <laughs> yeah probably yeah, sure. would be a nice little idea uh, <laughs> well it would have been nice if you told me yeah but I mean you should have known like we're a pretty powerful faction we kind of just have blaze <laughs> on blaze like, on blaze uh, uh, this was built to accommodate six. I don't know. Oh gosh. Um, about that, yeah. Just, just. I, I mean, we can make it as high as we want. Like, we can make it go all the way to the top. Of course. Of course. We'll just have to. Um, I guess we'll just have to talk with our faction. Um, is it possible to make it just 100% automatic so that they die to the water and then they drop this stuff or no? Does that not work? I don't think so. Oh, I don't think they dang. Drop this stuff if, if it dries by water. Yeah, I'm mm, not sure. I, I don't, I have they no, might. I, they might, uh, the thing is because if, since we have our blaze or since we have our iron golem spawner right here and then since like if we're AFKing that overnight, I don't want the blaze to keep on spawning, you know, cause like, I feel like it'll just, it'll just cause the, uh, the freaking base to lag like crazy. Well, you just, you sit here and you come back every 10 minutes and just clean them up with a sword. Yeah. But like, I mean, like what if I want to AFK overnight? Like if I want to AFK overnight and just, you know, make a qu quick money that way. Like what? Like that's not gonna work, man. That's not gonna work. Well, that's not my fault. That that, but that is your fault. You're the guy who's who's in charge of all that. Nope. <laughs> we need a scapegoat then. Who should we blame? We gotta blame somebody. We can just blame Dylan. Just blame. Uh, uh, but Dylan's not in our faction. That doesn't work. That doesn't work for this situation, oh, okay. man. Uh, then who in our? Who do we use to blame? Um, who's Dylan. Like blame guy. We we blame uh, Dylan anyway. Okay. Well, <laughs> so should we just go back to that? <laughs> Yeah, it's just so if this doesn't work, we'll just blame Dylan for just everything. Yeah. Dylan, come on. Alrighty, I'm gonna have to. Okay, I'm gonna let Kiwi finish this. Let me go to slash ho or warp shop. I'm gonna get some lava buckets, dude. We're, I'm gonna beat you, man. I'm gonna beat you yeah, through this you, build. Yeah, you probably are, dude. Cause now you said I need to go all the way to the top. That's, <laughs> that's too much for me. Uh, where are all the buckets? I'll just grab water buckets and then dump them out in the Nether. I have a homestead in the Nether. I think I should be okay. Do, 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 slash home nether. I, I've been using the same home nether like for ages, bro. Uh, throw that away. Oh no, I dropped the buckets. Why? There we go. Throw these away, throw these away, put this in here. And then just throw all these out and replace them with the good old, um, good old lava buckets. Man, this lava is so loud in my ear, Brent. What is going on? One, two, Sorry, three, dude. four. One, two, three, four. Boom, 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 boom. Okay. Let's get this over here. Man, uh, the thing the thing about factions is some people... I don't understand why some people don't even try to... um, They don't even try to make money anymore. They just want to go PvP. And I'm like, that's not what factions is all about. You guys got to... That's the fun part, dude. It's true. It is, it, it is the fun part. But, like, you guys got to make money. Like, you can't... Like, if you just go PvPing all day, like, you're not going to be able to... You're not going to be able to sustain yourself after a while. It's just all... All just really, really bad after that, man. It's just I don't know. Some people are just weird like that, I guess. 
um, slash home. All right, let me actually build up here. I'm gonna set us home right over here slash home hopper. All right, so guys, if you guys ever wondered how I actually do this, um, I make this infinite lava source look perfect. This is how I do it. Ready? I'm gonna show you guys real quick here. I, I put a I put a layer right at the end right here, and then I just go down the line like this. So, oh god, no, no, no. All right, there we go. Just make sure you just have to make sure everything is perfect and make sure that you don't forget anything. Um, yeah, god apples definitely help when you're working with lava guys. So make sure you guys have god apples for this portion. Oops. Um, put this here. Put this here. And then just kind of follow this throughout all the way throughout like this. It's it's really really simple, guys. It's um. The one reason why we don't have lava buckets in the shop is because of the fact that people like to cobble monster and lag the server. And um, I don't know how to exactly, I try, I've tried to disable things that would make cobble monster super, super simple. It just doesn't work well. And then we're still, still trying to figure that out. Still trying to figure that out. Alright, so let's put this here, here, and here. Watch out, dude. Watch out. What are you doing? Yeah, slow him down. <laughs> what are you doing? Let me put the lava right there, dude. Alright, here we go. So that's what I do like that, guys, and then I repeat the same process over and over and over again until I have perfect, perfect lava sources going all the way. So then, and the, the corners are the easiest part, by the way, guys. The corners are the easiest things you guys can do because you can literally just come over here and just boop and then bloop, and then that's, that's like a normal lava source right there. And just repeat this process over and over going all the way to the end, and you should be good. Brent's making his nice little sexy design. I think that's what he's going for. I think Kiwi's going to die to freaking lava. Uh, slash set home hopper. Let me go to slash home. Forever, dude. You want to you want to do a quick pause and then just go ahead and uh, continue from there and just kind of uh, knock it off Maybe right I, there, I guess. I gotta fill in all this glass now. All right, let, let, let's do that. Let's do that. Let's go into a quick pause. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and work the rest of this. Um, I'm gonna finish the lava placements. Uh, Brant's gonna finish his glass, and then we'll both kind of explain our farms. And Brant, we have five key case openings right at the end of this, and we're gonna test our luck all at right. the very very end. All right. Mm -hmm. All right. Quick pause. Here we go, guys. We're done. Finally. Oh my god, that took way too freaking long. Guys, um, this is what we decided to come up with or kind of kind of uh, explain to you guys what exactly we built. He's a senior mod, guys. If you guys are wondering why he's flying, it's because he's a senior mod. But anyways, um, Kiwi rated both of our uh, bases, or both of our spawner builds. He rated mine a 6.9. <laughs> with a winky kinda face kind of low, low. low and then look at your rating bro <laughs> a 3 out of 10 but it says cute but yours says cute <laughs> but I got a winky face I think I win I don't know alright so I, I, I finished I fixed my I basically um I finished my um spawner area first because obviously mine was a little bit easier compared to what Brent's was doing but so while Brent was actually making his little design here um I went ahead and did a little bit of a redstone mechanism so Brent if you want to come just look back here real quick yep. um I attached it to a button very very simple and the buttons just pop feed into two little dispensers that are on both sides and uh we did this so that if you press this button it actually dispenses water and so that if somebody is afking in the afk pool overnight they like the blazes don't stack and then they just basically just kill themselves with the water now we did check and uh, we looked at it a little bit and we found out that if we do uh, if the blazes do die by the water they don't drop anything and this is so this water is only basically here just so that if we are afking overnight it doesn't stack all the blazes up because both spawners are very very close to one another so whenever we are afking for the blaze though we can go ahead and just hit this and then we'll be good to go and then we can just kill with looting swords and uh, loot all this all we want what are you looking at what are you <laughs> what? There, there were golems in here burning to death. Oh no, no, no! They were. That's just that's just a visual glitch because the freaking uh, thing is just right up right above there. But yeah, just a very very simple spawner room here. Bla or you wanna you wanna explain yours like how yours works a little uh, bit? All right, well mine's pretty simple. You know, it's just they float down into the water and get, uh, you know get pushed to the hoppers and you just kill them there. But uh, other than that, it, nothing. There's a viewing area on top, of course. Mm -hmm. So you can get on top and look down. Oh, wh why didn't we make? Why didn't I make the AFK pool? You should have told me you had a viewing area up here. I thought this was just all blocks, because like oh, we could have. It's cool. What the hell is Kiwi doing over there with my spawner room? You see that? What is he doing he's over there? With a what the heck is he? Oh, shit. I think he want he wants a golem. I think as a pet. Yeah, he does. No, what is he? <laughs> what is he doing? <laughs> it's not working out. For him. It's not working out. Whatever he's trying to do, he's not. <laughs> <laughs> LOL Kiwi, you suck. <laughs> Guys, he's flying because he's a senior mod. He's he's not he's not doing it to abuse it or anything. I don't know what the hell he's trying to do. <laughs> <laughs> but anyways, um, right before we end today's episode, guys, um, I bought, I just bought myself ten keys. I put it in my e chest. Brent, let me go ahead and give you five of them. Um, here, can I can I drop these? I don't know if these are droppable. Here, can I just drop those to you? 
see if you can pick those up. Can you? I think I have them. All right, so let's go ahead. Let's empty out our inventory. Let's just leave them in our little build chest over here. Just empty out your inventory, right. whatever you don't need anymore. And then we'll head to spawn and test our luck with a total of 10 freaking keys. Oh my gosh, here we go. These get excited. I have one. If you didn't know, Brent, I have access to the master. Or no, I have access to the challenger kits and to the platinum. Oh, no, no. What was it? challenger kits and then to the diamond kits as well because that's what i have like i, I won a God. kit in the middle of an episode it was amazing <laughs> all right you got your five keys on you yeah all right let's go to slash spawn um uh, do you want to do you want to go first or should we go at the same time uh i think we'll go at the same time I'm gonna wait do these e do these even work yeah they do oh i just accidentally clicked one here we go i got come on baby come on baby fifty dollar armor kit i got a i got a silver kit see what I get. all right you go first we'll take turns we'll take turns Come on, Brent. Come on, Brent. Oh, oh. A $50 armor kit. What is that? I got It's a silver kit. I just got oh, the same thing. All right, here we go. I'm going to go ahead and... Here we go. My turn. I want the money. I want the money, baby. <laughs> Give me the money, baby. We're going together, dude. Yeah, that's fine. That's fine. Got us $50 armor kit again. God dang it. I don't even know what I got. Oh, I got a bronze minion kit. Okay. Bronze minion kit. All right, ready? Three, two, one. Click. One. Go! Come oh, on! Give me, I want a rank, I want bedrock, or I want money. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. I just want the bedrock, man. Oh! God dang it! Ah, we got 50k. That's not bad. Oh, that's not too bad. That's not too bad. Alright, three, two, one, go! I went before you. Oh my god. <laughs> BM, bro. BM. I want to see what I get first. Come on! $20 Come on. sword kit. Oh, 50. I keep getting the silver minion kits, man. Oh my gosh. Alright, last key. Last key. Last key. Three. Wait, wait, hold on. Let Dude. me let me drop these. Let me drop these. These, these guys, these guys at spawn can have these, man. There you go. I keep the keep the golden apples. Keep the life forces. Keep the life forces. All right, I'll give them all this stuff. All right, three, two, I'm drop the key. one, go. Oh, come on, baby. Come on, Ray. come on, baby. Come on, baby. Come on. Uh, oh no. Ah, this is too addicting. Hold on, I'm gonna buy ten more. Hold on, give me a second. Let me have. <laughs> Uh, let me buy 10. D don't even pause it. Don't even pause it right here. I'm not, I'm not going to pause it. All right, all right. Hold on. I want to buy 10 more keys. Let me hop onto the store real quickly. I'll, I'll split them with you again. I'll split them with you again. Um, all right. Let's go. Do, 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 do. Um, how do I how do I, how do I purchase multiple? I think I just purchased one. Does that one. work? Buy, craft, reload. I want that key right now, man. Come on. There we go. I got one key. Oh my. Okay, wait. Let me go purchase more. Let me. Get, your purchase packages have been credited. I have to buy these one at a time. Hold on. Let's do a quick, quick, quick pause. Buy these All keys right. really quickly, and then we'll be good to go. We're back. All right. Six keys. Let's go. What? What the hell happened to your head? I. I, I don't know. Someone gave me a head. <laughs> you look like <laughs> you look like the broken Alex skin. All right. Ready? Three, <laughs> two, one. Go. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. I want to rank. I want to rank so badly. Oh, I got a hundred dollar. I got a hundred dollar sword kit. That's not too bad. That's not bad. That's not too bad. All right, here we go again. That's Three, two, one. Went. Oh my, dude, you need to wait. <laughs> you freaking no, cheater. Dude, I, I need to go before you. <laughs> Come on, lady $20 luck. Armor kit. Oh, I got the same thing. Three, two, one, go. Come oh, wait, on. You are walking in front of me. <laughs> I, I got, I got mine already. I want the, I want the hundred dollar rank. Hundred dollar rank it would be lovely. Got another hundred dollar sword kit. Not too bad. Hundred dollar armor kit. Nice, nice. Oh, that's a platinum. Keep that. Keep that. That's yeah, good. That's good. That that's good. One. All right, let me drop all this stuff here. All right, I've got I've got two keys left. I'm opening my third. Here I we got go. A, got another platinum ar armor kit. I can't believe I haven't gotten money yet. I normally get money a lot. Got <laughs> another got twenty dollar armor kit. God dang it. The luck is not with us today, man. Twenty dollars. This is so addicting. This is so addicting. No, use it, bro. No balls. I'm use afraid. it, dude. Come I on. I did it. I did it. Oh yes, I got twenty thousand. Okay. Whew. Worth. Hashtag worth. Last one. Last one. Here we go. Three, two. Oh, I got a twenty dollars sword kit. Lame. All right, come on. This is my last one. Come on, baby. Give me a rank. Give me a rank. Come on. Give me a rank. Right, come, on, come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Oh no. Twenty dollars sword kit. <laughs> Brent, the luck was just not with us today, man. The luck was just not with us today. But anyways, guys, thank you for watching today's Factions Let's Play episode. I kind of want to do every single episode. We maybe open like five keys each. I think that'd be something really cool that, that we could add. Fun. That would I be... Like 
it's so addicting. I want to just do yeah, more. It's like gambling. Dude. It is. It is kind of like it. What the heck? But anyways, guys, if you guys want us to do more of these crate openings, like probably at the end of every episode, we'll do like five crates each or something like that. Leave a comment down below and like the video on both of our channels. But Brent, do you have any final words to say before we end today's uh, factions let's play episode? Stay big. Alright guys, thank you so much for watching. This is D Field and Young Tater. We'll see you guys later.